All right. Well, um, this painting is called The Devil and the Dead, and it's about um, at the beginning of the Nazi occupation in Germany, uh, they gathered up four very specific groups of people that they were afraid of or, or um, disliked, and they were, uh, of course, the Jew, the homosexual, the disabled, and the intellectual. And I just thought that would make a very interesting snapshot and give people some insight into the way dictatorships work and, and, the, type of, uh, and the type of people that they're afraid might undermine their ability to control the population. Well, I, I've always been really interested in socially, socially relevant art and music, and uh, I just thought this would be a great way to create a beautifully aesthetic thing to hang on the wall, but also keep those um, socially relevant things in the, in the background. I've been painting pictures about atrocities for about 12 years. Well, uh, I've painted paintings about, uh, about the May Lai Massacre from Vietnam, um, about Iraq, Afghanistan, the dropping of the bomb on Hiroshima. Um, just basically anywhere that I feel that innocent life is lost, uh, I think can make a painting that people should see. I have. Um, I, I painted one that was uh, called Buffalo Hunters, and it was about the, uh, the, when the travelers headed west, um, they would shoot bison just for fun from trains, and of course that, uh, that really decimated the bison population and, uh, and also hurt the Native American. I, I always paint in acrylic. Yeah, and it's all, it, I hand stretch my own canvases and, uh, and uh, I, I use very thin acrylic as you can see so that it doesn't have any texture because I, I really want it to have that kind of single plane look, almost, almost fresco-like but very flat. I would say my main, um, for subject, would probably be um, Picasso, um, Diego Rivera. Um, as far as style goes, this has really just been an evolution of, of the last 12 years. I mean, it's really been... It started very simple and much more cartoonish and generalized, and it, it got much more specific where the uniforms are, are as they look, the, you know, the trains and the city scenes, and I look, I look for what the cities look like that are involved, um, and, uh, and it just evolved into there and into this style where I feel very comfortable with the whole general look of the canvases at this point. Well, like I said, I've always been really interested in, in, in socially or politically motivated music. Um, I, uh, I, think, I think once I saw Guernica by Picasso, it just it made me feel that, that this is what I think I should do. Not all artists, but I think that I should do this because it's, it's a way to make, it, to make a, a statement and maybe even do something you know, positive uh, with my artwork. So.